Well, hello everyone. It is a special edition Thursday, October the 14th, 2021 edition of Your Status Chat. Now today, one of the things that's going to make it special other than being on Thursday is I have a big expo with all of the benchmark folks tomorrow and that means I'm not going to be available to do it at its regular time so we're going to do it today and we're going to keep it short because we got to get this in the can and uploaded produced uploaded and uh, distributed or as we say uh, distributed some people don't like the guy my pronunciations but uh, that's what that is and I'll just get right here to the numbers just as quickly as I get back from the advert. Hello I'm Del Delbridge of Benchmark Realty Murfreesboro Tennessee. If you are currently unrepresented and would like to know how to compare up to three properties side by side and room by room then go over to my new YouTube channel Call Dell to Sell. That's one L and Dell no spaces. Watch the demo on Real Scout and then call me and we'll set up your exclusive ad-free account today. Now that we got that done, I will say in my private life today, I did enjoy some of this prosperity this new system seemed to be bringing up. I called for an order of uh, propane. I live out in the country as it is and we have no natural gas uh, pipelines out here. And my price was $3.49 a gallon for liquid propane and uh, that wasn't even before the big price range hit. Now, last year, last time I bought gas, $1.49 a gallon. So I'm not real good at numbers. Actually, I can get them. But, you know, from $1.49 to $3.49 is two more dollars. And that's more than a 100% increase in that because obviously a buck fifty would be three bucks and we're more than a hundred percent increase we're hearing about supply chain issues and we're already seeing inflation jump way up the last couple of episodes i showed you one i showed you the renter renters index and the other one i showed you the actual buyer index on it and prices are going up so uh, I don't see them coming down in the near future. Again, that's the same problem. When you spend money you don't have, it costs you a lot more to pay it back. And we're right now basically a bankrupt uh, nation. We, we produce in so much more dollars in the printing press than we have a gross domestic product to back it up. Our value is going down and uh, gasoline propane cost of inputs and and there's no way to run around that it, energy goes into everything running cars alpha batteries uses electricity where are we going to get that electricity from nuclear power plant we have built a nuclear power plant in the united states in decades i think i think watts bar was one of the last few that came online uh, which is kind of in between east tennessee and middle there kind of in between that area um, most of our energy I think is still coal and Texas over last winter showed us that uh, the the green renewable stuff doesn't work when it snows and the wind doesn't work when the wind quits blowing so we're gonna have to have some kind of energy and unlike uh, burning that up we have an environmental issue of how do we recycle the batteries and uh, someone who drives a Prius, that's an issue. I think last time I looked, they told me it's going to cost about five, six thousand dollars to have batteries placed in in the Prius when it's time. So now we got that. We've extended our show a little bit. Let's get our numbers. The previous week, 10-8-21, the one we just uh, got rid of a week ago is 10270 in the Opportunities of Real Scout System. That includes your coming soon because they're officially on the market. You can buy them, you just can't show them. 4549 was the under contracts, but still marketing, still showing them. Both of those numbers were up. And the ratio in the energy value was at 44%. Now, this week we have 10171, which is in our opportunities, which means our inventory is going down a little bit. And if you want to sell a house, now is a good time to do it because with inventory trickling off, we have an opportunity to uh, 
gets you shown pretty quick. 4658 is the number of under contract still showing. That was up, the other was down. So we have actually switched by two percentage points in the integer level when we round them up. Uh, to some extent, things are slowing down a little bit. It's also a good time to buy, even though the inventory typically trails off this time of year. We still have some good mortgage rates and we still have people looking we used to have people selling but there is a little bit perhaps a little bit of jitteriness going into christmas and all this supply chain issues that we're, we're hearing about it certainly throws the monkey wrench into it anyway we're going to have this released on thursday night when i shoot it i've pushed it till way after dark so that our numbers will be fairly close to a friday morning when i normally would take the the numbers for the book and we'll go from there so I want you to have a good weekend and hopefully we'll have something good to come back after a big show Friday